Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. I wanted to bring you guys an update on the 55 gallon. I'm gonna scroll through and see if you can see the updates. If you notice anything missing or anything added to the tank. But if you didn't notice, I will go a little bit closer. So, I do have baby tears in this tank now, and I don't have CO2, so I'm just testing it out to see how it goes. It was only like $4, so why not test it, right? And I moved the sewer plant over there, but that's not too much of the update that I wanted to show you guys. I want to show you what's in the back. They're kind of like hiding right now. You can see them. Now, once they get big, they will have their own tank. Once they grow to size, they will have their own tank. They're just in here temporarily. I do have more tanks that aren't being used. As you remember, I had five tanks. Yeah, I only have up two up and running right now. So, yeah, they will have their own tank to be in if... That's only if they don't get along with the Gorami. That's the only fish I believe that they would probably mess with in this tank. Like to the point where the Gorami is like going to be stressed out. But right now they're too small. The Gorami is not worried about them. They're not worried about the Neon Tetra. The Black Neon Tetras and the Neon Tetras aren't worried about them. The Clown Barbs aren't worried about them. Nobody's messing with them. So they're fighting here for now. Trust me. I'm watching them. That's still a piece piece of cucumber that I gotta take out of there. They like made sure to eat all of that. So there's four in there, and they're fine right now. They're fine. Trust me, they're fine. They're not messing with anything. They're not eating my plants yet, because I know they will rip up your plants. They might not eat them, but they'll rip them up once they get big. But you know, till they you know get of size then they'll be in here because why set up another tank like right right this instant when they're finding here i would have had the tank up and running with another filter but i'll let you guys know about the other filter that was in this tank i don't know if you guys even noticed that the other filter is gone but i want to get you this update before it moves now as you can see, I have ghost shrimp in here. Well, you can see one ghost shrimp. But there's many more in here that are hiding, which I'm happy that they're hiding because they're smart. There's a ghost shrimp right there too. And a lot of people will say, you're not supposed to have them there. You can't really see it. And I'm not. Because the Garamia eat them, the clown barbs that eat them, and if the Tetris can fit them in the mouth, they'll eat them too. So, not supposed to have them with them, but I do. I always test it. If you've watched any of my past videos, I put shrimp in with angelfish, and they did perfectly fine as long as it has coverage and places to hide, just like in the wild. That one's just swimming. I don't know if you can see it, but it's like right there. It's just swimming around the tank like it's not going to get eaten. So, you know, they're fine. <laughs> they know when to move and when not to move. So, they're in there. There's only like, there's how many? 12 for a 12 for dollar. So, picked up a bunch of them. Figured I'd put them in there. I know they have places to hide, so why not, right? Next, they was the ones that I was testing with. Next will be Neocaridinus. I wasn't going to buy $5 shrimp and then, you know, put them in here and not know if they'll be able to hide or not. So those were the testers, ghost shrimp. Now that those are fine, I'm going to add Neocaridinus in here and have them like all over there. But they are smaller, so that's the thing about that. They're smaller than the ghost shrimp most times. Some get bigger, though. Well, not bigger, but as big. And I'm going to show you the filter that is gone. There's no filter on here anymore. I do have the plant still in here. 
the roots are like back there as you can see earlier in the video and the plants right there I do still have one filter on I'm gonna take this one off and like maybe you know a while it's gonna be a while before I take this one off but that one's still there the other filter is with a my sister-in-law she does have she just now got a tank and I gave her the filter so that it can be cycled a little bit like faster than faster than uh, normal so all the beneficial bacteria is now in that tank and they have it going so that they can put the fish in it so so I, it's one of the 20 gallons that I had a spare because I was, have like a bunch of them so I gave them that tank uh, gave them the, the filter out of this tank they filled it up with water I gave them the solution and everything they needed to start the tank and I don't think they're gonna do plants it's just bare bottom right now so and then I gave them a log and what else the log and then I gave them a, like fake plants to put in there just for you know something to look at right now so that's pretty much the update uh, you can see it's floating around I didn't bury that one enough they're not ripping it up surprisingly they didn't rip that up I didn't bury it right uh, I would think that the clown barbs would rip this up since it's so like small but they haven't touched it yet it's been in there like a overnight maybe it'll take a while and it'll start ripping it up if so I do have extra in the 29 gallon my wife's tank is extra in there so it'll be growing in there and I have the s weapons in there too I put it in that tank so it'll grow in there and grow in here if it doesn't grow in here then it'll grow in there because the light is like right on top of the tank and it's 29 gallon so less light penetration from the water is needed so that's pretty much the update I'm a, I will see you guys in the next video and the freaking Daniel is still in there the last Daniel is still in there I'm not sure if I even want to get more Daniels <laughs> but that's it uh, that's the update for today if I see anything later on maybe I'll update again Thanks for watching. Peace. No. Listen, y'all. These kids want to act up in school, want to go to school and embarrass you, want to make like they got no home training. So I told my son, don't go to school basketball no more. I take care of you, son. I give you anything you want. I discipline you. But you're going to embarrass me like this? No, so now I'm going to cut his hair, send him to school with a bald head.